Because since then, we've been taking out the seats there for the first time they've done that. And on some councils, they may even hold the balance of power. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye. So the SCLP may be forced to deal with a party whose politics of violence they're dedicated to fighting. But the party leader remains confident. I am very confident that the steady leadership that the SDLP has given over the years is really coming through to people now, uh, and that the contradiction between the Armalite and the ballot paper uh, of Sinn Féin is, is coming through to people very, very strongly, uh, and is having a serious effect on, on, on their support. Is that, that's why you think they peaked this time? Well, I, I thought they'd peaked the last time, and I was right. I think they're deep peaking now. There was some delight in the SDLP offices over a campaign scoop by the local paper. One of the Sinn Féin candidates, it revealed, had been convicted of trying to blow up the Guildhall, where he now wants to sit as a councillor. But because of the peculiar the way politics work here, Sinn Féin weren't in the least upset about that. Indeed, there was even a suggestion that they leaked the story themselves, in an effort to remind them.